for a usually slow time of the year. This particular summer slash fall season has a lot of noteworthy games. And there's one in particular that I want to talk to y'all about today. So let's get into it. What's up, peoples? What's up, peoples? What's up, peoples? It is your boy, MM2K, back again with another one. Hey, yo, do me a huge favor. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Rock those bells for notifications, please. So you know when your boy's dropping these doses. I appreciate all of y'all straight up because you know the deal. I'm not too proud to ask. All right, we're going to do something a little different today, okay? Um, on the heels of Gamescom coming and all the excitement that's going on there and a lot of the coverage that broadband bullies pnts heart knock digital culture all that's coverage that your boy mm2k is going to be doing along with my peers you know what i'm saying we got a little bit of buffer time here to just talk about games coming in the near future all right so you got control um people are looking forward to the obsidian game out of worlds coming you know what i'm saying bunch of little games on the periphery double a triple a whatever the case may be coming out i want to tell you this though there was one particular game that caught your boy's eye. It caught my eye at E3 this past year. Okay. And it was a game that I am glad. See, let me back, let me back up a little bit and, and, and explain something to you. See, your boy MM2K watches all shows, absorbs everything because you might always miss a diamond in the rough if you don't keep your head on a swivel. You hear me saying that all the time, right? Right, okay. Now, I get it. The PC game show, 99.9999999% of it is trash. And I prefer gaming on the PC as of late. You know what I'm saying? And even I know that as a fact. But again, each year, the PC game show always has these little trinkets or these little gems that make me excited. You know what I'm saying? It was Stormlands in 2018 and 2019. It is a little known game called Remnant from Ashes. So this is what I want to do. All right. I was watching this game, E3 2019 at the PC game show. And I was like, wow, this may not be full AAA, maybe like a sub AA, you know, right in the middle between AA and AAA game. It's made by the same people that made the Defiance game and rebooted Defiance and Defiance 2050. Um, I think the, 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 the name of the team is Arc Interactive. Um, I still play Defiance 2050 to this day, but this is definitely a step above Defiance, okay? Now what this is, it's like a survival action shooter with co-op elements and stuff into it. You know what I'm saying? And you know, your boy MM2K loves those hardcore gritty games. A lot of them um, have been thrown to the wayside for these more tearjerker story-driven games. You know what I'm saying? If they do got any hardcore elements, you know what I mean? And I I, I just can't get into to tearjerkers, okay? I want, I, I want, like I always tell you, I want to see ass kicked. I want to be doing the ass kicking, okay? And this is a kick-ass game nonetheless, as it appears. Um, it's an open world game and it's actually co-op. You know, a lot of sci-fi, mysterious, magical stuff going on here. I really urge you guys to pick it up um, if you like this type of stuff. If you're not sure if you want to pick it up yet, check out Remnant From Ashes on YouTube, Twitch, Mixture, they're everywhere. And they started a small following. I'm actually part of the Discord. And there's a lot of excitement and anticipation for this game. Now, as far as I know, at the time of this recording, right now, I think it's just slated to come out for the Xbox and PC on the 20th. I don't think, or the 20th of August, 2019, to be exact. I'm not 100% sure if the PlayStation 4 is releasing on that day. And the only reason why I say that is because when I pre-ordered the game for PC, and when, when I was looking at the option for getting it for, for PlayStation 4, it said coming soon. So maybe just the pre-orders ain't up yet, whatever the case may be. Very interesting looking game. It's not full AAA retail. It's only 40 bucks, right? So again, if you're in the summer slash fall hall looking for games, 
you don't have a serious back. Even if you do got a serious backlog, I got a backlog. But if you're still looking for something new and fresh, game, I know gamers are always looking for new and fresh stuff. I highly urge for you to, at the very least, take a look at Remnant from the ashes. Even a little clip that I'm showing you right now doesn't do it all the justice. You know what I'm saying? Check it out on YouTube. Check it out on social media. Join the Discord. You know what I'm saying? Talk to them. All other stuff is, is a very engaging and um, very entertaining community. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, I want to do something a little bit different um, heading into Gamescom, and hopefully, I've shared something with the community opposed to me bloviating about Phil and kicking his ribs in all the time or talking about something crazy going on in the community. We got good news here too, baby. And with that being said, hopefully you got some good news out of that. This is it from your boy MM2K. And you know what you gotta do for me. Let me know what you think. Cause who cares what I think about today's video, any video in the comment section below. Like I always tell you, you can come with me and come at me. It does not matter to your boy. But if you did like what I had to say, check out the links below to follow me. I do a show with your peoples, Neethles, Snow Bunny, Dirk Griggity. It's called Scrampunks. We do it every Wednesday, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Check out hashtag Scrampunks for more information on that. Definitely check out my brethren, the Broadband Bullies. We got her doing the damn thing. The Discord, the link to the gear, the link to the Patreon. It's all below. Check it out. You know what I'm saying? And last but not least, your boy is doing something different, unique, and it's definitely going to be entertaining. We got all types of guests coming. That particular thing is called the Hard Knock Digital Culture. Check it out on my Twitch channel, which is twitch.tv forward slash Mighty Most 2000. We're highlighting hardcore gritty games like this and hardcore media, which includes anime and martial arts. And with that being said, hey, y'all, enjoy the festivities at GamesCon. We'll be reporting it, covering it. And with that said, y'all have a wonderful gaming day. Peace.